action. So how's the house hunt going, babe? What's up, guys and girls? Well, poo. All right, we've seen three houses so far today. The first one was the one that I was in love with right beforehand, before we even saw them, like, in person. And then we went and looked at it, and I was like, yeah, we're getting this house. We're getting it. I was like, go ahead and put the offer in. And, I, and Amy was like, well, let's finish looking, blah, blah, blah. And we went and looked at another house. It's pretty crappy. It was poop on the floor. It really wasn't poop on the floor. Okay? It was bad <laughs> carpet. We'll say that, okay? The carpet was bad. That Anyways, wasn't the issue. That can be there, replaced. What was the there issue? There was a huge telephone pole in the backyard. And it wasn't up against the fence or anything. It was like smack dab in the center of the fence. It wasn't, wasn't in the center either. But it was, it was out in the open. It was Very big of an up. eyesore. It was too big of an eyesore to, to, to overlook. I mean, it had, the house had good features in certain areas. But overall, it went to the bottom of the list, right? So we still had the first one on the top. And then we went and looked at the third one. The third one looked pretty good. Until... You look at the price and how much. Did somebody fart? <laughs> Who farted? Dude, did you fart? <laughs> Anyways, we, the 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 third house, the price. It could be the dog poop on my shoe. The price, okay. It wasn't. It, it's the high end of what we're paying. But they're motivated. They're sellers. motivated to sell. So it, it was obviously it went to the second area. It went to the second rung. Okay, so when we left, we told our agent, go ahead and put an offer, see how they feel about an, off an offer. Like no, we're checking the utility bills yeah, we first. We were going to check the utility but we were putting an offer on that person, okay? That's what was going to happen. Come to find out, there's oh. already six offers on the house, and, and they accepted one yesterday at 5 p.m. So why did we even go look at it? And? So I'm bummed because that house is really good. And I'm talking, kid. Yes, it was almost so perfect. Now we're probably going to put an oh, offer on this third house that we went and looked at. And see what happens. We're, we're still, we still have another house to go look at today, and one to look at tomorrow too. But kind of bummed because we were like trying to decide between the first one and the third one. It was like, okay, which one? And me and Amy both were kind of on the fence. I was more like ninety percent the first one and ten percent this third one. And she said she was at what sixty-five percent on the first one and fifty-five percent on the <laughs> third one. And I told her your math's a little off, honey. Come on. What's up with your math? What's up with your math, babe? And. And wait, mommy's talking. I meant 55, 45. Is what no, no, yeah, 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 that's what you meant. But yes, I like the first one a little bit better. But I like the neighborhood of the third one better. So This third one's neighborhood is a big selling point, guys. It, the the house values in, in the neighborhood are high, which is good when you're buying a house is another tip. If the house values are high, that means it's got stability there and you, you could make your money back if you had to sell. But yeah, whatever. And it had lots of mature trees, which we love. So, I don't know, but we're bummed about the first one. So now we're gonna go get BJ's. Oh, yeah, man. BJ's. All right, so we're gonna attempt to do something today that has never been done before. There's a four-year-old that wants to pluck mommy's eyebrows while she's putting makeup on. How's that going, honey? Holy moly. Oh, there, you gotta hold that down. Yeah, tell her. Oh my gosh, this is scary looking. Oh man! All right, get one more, dude. We're gonna get in closer and see it this time now. Come on, come on, mommy. Stop, Dad. stop being scared. Let it happen, mama. Baby, don't pinch the skin. Pinch uh, he's got it, babe. He knows what he's doing. Here. He knows what he's doing. Get your hands out of the way. See? <laughs> come on, show her. Frozen. You gotta hold it close, mama. I want to be able to see what you're no, doing. No, come on. Though. Okay, go. Go. You got it, dude. You ready for this, mommy? No. Four-year-old pulling hairs for mommy. Oh, almost. <laughs> There you go, nice and steady hand. Look at that handiwork he's got there. Ah. Oh. <laughs> you don't want to finish him for her? Oh my goodness. Can I try? No. <laughs> Come on. Look, it's a seven year old. Let the seven year old try now. Look, I'm gonna this Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, he sees. Just, just give it to him, he'll figure it out. See that little straight hair that's right Yeah, there? just pull it, dude. <gasps> That's not true. <laughs> <laughs> wow, dude. I was like, oh no. <laughs> FYI, guys, it's raining cats and dogs. See, there's a dog. It's raining. You hear it, guys? So I'm pumping gas here, right, guys? And I see this cop that's sitting right, right over there. I'm like, why is there a cop sitting there? And then I just realized it. Check it out. Okay, there's a cop. This truck's kind of in the way now, dang it. But look, can you guys see it? Watch, be looking, be looking. The sign fell, a little light. 
So we stopped to get a snack because for the boys, for the boys because it's 3:30 in between lunch and dinner. But me and you didn't eat yeah. lunch, right? And uh, so the boys didn't want to eat all theirs. So Eric is devouring them for them. <laughs> I told them they did good. My like Xander took two bites of this, so I said I'd finish it. <laughs> he ate enough. Plus, I have some wings. Have you ever been to Zaxby's before, people? I, I, I've been a long time ago. I don't really remember much about it. But these yeah. little nibblers are good. Amy got some potato chips, and they're called, what, tater chips or something like that? Yeah, something like that. And they're pretty good. Oh, man. It's some good food. I, mean, I don't know if it's just because I'm starving right now. <laughs> I think it's probably what. a combination. But, man, these nibblers are awesome. But you're not supposed to be filling up. It's only a snack because we're going out to eat We're going to P.F. Chang's. We are. I don't know what place. That's gonna be good lettuce, lettuce wraps. Lettuce wraps. You know lettuce wraps? With all those creepy statues. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Oh, creepy statues, I'm Yay. here! Yay, <laughs> so did you tell them about our house, honey? Flip yeah, that camera around and talk to them for a minute while I finish I my face. Huh? I don't know what you're talking about. Yesterday's house hunting experience. They know we were looking at houses. And we uh, already yeah. told them. We did? Yeah. We told you guys? Yeah. If we didn't tell you guys, leave a comment below. Show us how you're eating your rice, Sander. What kind of spoon do you have? Aha! Is that for rice? <laughs> Is it good? I think that's for soup though, not for rice. Kind of hard to get it out, isn't it? I don't care. You don't care? <laughs> I like your float, Jacob. Nice and pink and pretty. <laughs> You guys are getting the camera all wet. I think we're in a bad spot. Are you guys having fun? Sandra, are you having fun? Hi. He's ignoring me. Colin, you cannot get our shit. That's you.